This is Apple's standard MacBook charger, and this is a charger from Novu. They look pretty similar in size. Matter of fact, the MacBook charger is slightly larger than the Novu charger. But what if I told you the Novu charger is actually almost twice as powerful as the MacBook charger? That's right. Apple's MacBook charger is a 67 watt charger, but the Novu is 120 watts. Let's find out more. Before I start, this is a sponsored video. Novu did send me the charger for free. However, as always, this does not impact my review, which remains objective and unbiased. Now, the reason the Novu charger is almost twice as powerful as the Apple charger, while being even smaller in size, is because the Novu charger is a GAN charger. Now, what is a GAN charger? Well, it's a charger that uses gallium nitride as a semiconductor instead of silicone, which has been traditionally used in chargers. Gallium nitride, or GAN, is a much faster and more efficient conductor of electricity than silicone, and being more efficient, it produces less heat, and this is why you can have a much faster, much more powerful charger in a smaller size compared to traditional silicon chargers. This particular charger from Novo, the RG120, has three different ports, so it's able to charge three different devices at the same time. And what I love about that is when I travel, and I do travel a lot, and I do travel with multiple devices, I'm usually traveling with two laptops, an iPad, and two phones, I only need to take this thing with me rather than a bunch of these, and I'm able to fast charge my laptops or charge three devices at the same time, all in this compact little thing. Now, a quick note on the power distribution. So if you're using this to charge only one device, if you use either of the two USB-C ports, you're gonna get a 100 watts charging power, which is gonna fast charge your laptops easily. If you use the USB-A port, you're only gonna get 22 and a half watts of power, but that's a limitation of the older USB-A standard. Now, if you use this to charge two devices at the same time, this is where things get a bit interesting. If you use both USB-C ports, you're gonna split that 120 watts in half and you're gonna get 60 watts per port or per device. That's more than enough to charge two laptops at the same time, almost as fast as the MacBook charger. However, things get interesting if you use the USB-A port. If you plug anything into the USB-A port, then it's gonna share 20 watts only between these two ports, so USB-C2 and USB-A. USB-C1, however, remains unaffected and will give you a full 100 watts. So if you're using the USB-A port, but also want to charge a laptop, then plug it into USB-C1, that's gonna give you a full 100 watts. If, however, using USB-A, but charging a low power device, then you can plug it into USB-C2, and it's gonna share 20 watts between those two ports. If you're charging three devices at the same time, USB-C1 is still gonna give you fast charging 100 watts, and then the remaining 20 watts are gonna be shared between USB-A and the second USB-C port. Now, limiting the second USB-C port to share 20 watts of power with USB-A is an interesting approach, uh, rather than a more balanced share of power, but more and more manufacturers are opting for that strategy nowadays. And when I actually asked the engineers at Novo about this, they explained that they went down that route to maximize compatibility with low power devices, which actually makes sense and gives you more versatility. And make sure that your laptop is always charging at high power, but you do have enough power to charge other devices that are not that power hungry. Now, I did test the charging speed. I charged two laptops at the same time, a 14-inch MacBook Pro and a 15-inch Dell, and I was able to charge both at the same time at 60 watts each, which is awesome. You can buy the RG120 from Novu for about $50 from Amazon. I'll put links in the description. However, as of this moment when I'm recording this video, there's actually a 30% coupon code on Amazon, which brings down the price of this to $35. I've bought a lot of chargers in the past, and even at $50, this is a steal. You get a 120 watt charger. You also get two USB-C cables in the box, a one and a half meter and a one meter cable. So even at $50, a 120 watt charger, two USB-C cables, that's a steal. $35, well, that's unbeatable. Let me know in the comments if you have any questions. And as always, if you liked the video, please hit the like button and consider subscribing to my channel as this encourages me to continue producing content. Until next time, cheers.